down cover plants are low growing plants that cling right down at soil level or maybe just grow a few centimetres above it. And they're really good in the garden because they stop soil erosion by binding the soil together, they repress weed growth and they're like a living mulch. Native ground covers in particular are a beautiful and extremely useful part of any garden, but because they're below eye level, can easily be overlooked. Well, I'm going to raise their profile and show you some different ways to put native ground covers to work in your garden. If you've got a shady spot, I've got some tough customers for you. This is kidney weed, and it's a beauty. And this one you might know is Viola heteraceae, the native violet, and it's a beauty too. Both of them form a delicate cover, right flat as a lawn without the mowing. Kidney weed also tolerates some foot traffic, while the native violets provide a bonus of pretty little white flowers or purple. They both put down new roots as they spread out, and that makes them ideal for holding soil in place. For a sunny spot, these are terrific. Scavola or the fan flower, little native plant that just forms a lovely mound. It has lots of different coloured flowers. You can get a blue one, a mauve one, or pink or white, and they're really good. If you're looking for a real champion for a ground cover, these are hard to beat. This is the fine-leafed Myoporum, and it's a beautiful plant, just forms a lovely carpet spreading out about two metres wide. And this one is the thicker-leafed Myoporum, and it's a beauty, a little bit of a purpley tinge to it, white flowers, but that forms a really thick carpet that really suppresses weeds. Try as they might, weeds will not pop through. I call that tough as an old goanna. Low-growing grevilleas are another great choice for keeping weeds at bay. They have beautiful flowers, they do well on a slope, and they can also cascade over a retaining wall. For a ground cover that will hide almost anything, try a hardened bergia. They're better known as a climbing plant, but if you let them go, just covering the ground, they will happily meander all over rocks and the soil. They'll just be beautiful for about two or three metres wide. And the beauty of them is you can get a purple form and a white form. And if you contrast those two, you get plenty of winter and spring colour. You can see that although Australian native ground covers tend to have a low profile, they really are tough, beautiful and useful plants that deserve a much higher status in your garden.